Welcome to WeWork Irving Place at 33 Irving Place in the Union Square neighborhood of Manhattan. You can visit this WeWork co-working space via mass transit using the 14th Street Union Square subway station. Use moonymeter.com to explore on video the neighborhoods surrounding New York City's we work co-working spaces exclusively and in 1920 by 1080 high definition and um, he was you know is such a big huge admirer of the Winklevoss twins um, and I kind of would look up to them as gods as well, you know. Um, I love, you know, I really like them. I, I just kind of sometimes would get nervous around them, especially after we first met. Um, but there was this weird aura and magical kind of relationship that Divya and I had, and the relationship he had with the twins, I kind of, you know, had the same relationship with them. Um, it definitely took time to cement and bond, um, but yeah, I mean, I looked up to these guys like anything. You know, I, w I was a part of their team. I would do anything that they said. I would believe anything that they told me, and it was, you know, one for all and all for one. Um, we would do things together until the very end, um, especially Divya and myself and this guy named Olive. You know, I, you know, it was absolutely the way it was. We were, it was like a movie. I specifically remember one night um, when the friendship between Divya, Olip, and myself, the, the three musketeers was at kind of like at all time highs and there was a lot of bromancing, bromancing going on and like it was like a heterosexual love fest and we just loved being around each other so much especially on friday and saturday nights when we would hit up marquee and on mondays was you know le souk and then we'd hit up the happy hours and 235th and picking up women and arguing over who found which club and who would get whose number and we'd watch the sopranos together not all of but you know divya and myself you know, I specifically remember those nights, and actually this happened on many nights, but I do remember one night outside of Marquee, we were a block or two away passing some playground, where we all kind of agreed that if one of us made it successful, that at the bare minimum, we would, without hesitation and without any problems, invite the others to all the parties basically so that we could pick up women and, and just have fun and enjoy. And it's just such a shame because it was, you know, kind of like, listen, we're going to be brothers for life. The bonds can never be broken. We're always going to be together and no one's going to break us apart. And fast forward however many years and we don't speak. Um, Olive doesn't have the nicest things to say about Divya. Divya doesn't have the nicest things to say about me. Will we ever get back together? Probably never. Um, I'm left out in the cold. Divya's worth a you know however many tens of millions of dollars. Um, I got screwed. Olive can't talk to me because he's afraid of what Divya's gonna say. The Winklevoss twins are kind of doing their own thing. Um, it's just really a shame at what happened and it's just, you know, this is the disgusting aspect of humanity. Um, and it's, 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 it's a shame because it's, 
this is not the life that we were supposed to be living. We were supposed to be living in harmony and in friendship together forever. Together forever. Together forever. Together forever. Together forever. Together forever.